Even more, Marcus here, back with another video, back with another Oculus Go video. This one's gonna be a quick one. People keep asking me, how do you get video files or any other files on or off the Oculus Go? Dead simple. There is a little bit of a, a trick, but uh, it's dead, dead simple. Most people probably know this, but just in case you don't, here we go. Grab the USB cable that comes with your headset. On the uh, left-hand side there, you've got a little USB port, micro USB. Plug that in on your Windows PC. I don't know if it works on Mac, but I do have Windows. Plug the other end into your PC. In it goes, and your PC will recognize your drive. So jump over here. So it recognizes it as a drive. So if you go into your folders here, you can see it says VR headset. You click into it, and it doesn't actually show anything. And you must be like, oh, why is that? Why, why is it not showing anything? Why can't I see any folders or anything like that? Aha, jump into your headset. There'll be a message that's popped up saying, allow access to data. The connected device will, will be able to access files on this headset. So basically you have to agree that your PC can access your Oculus Go. So click allow with your controller and then your PC will pop again. And then if you check your drive, your folders, when you click on VR headset, you now get internal shared storage. Double click on there and you can get into your Oculus Go. So from there, you can access the different folders. Uh, most of the folders are kind of literally just a folder structure. Uh, movies is quite good because most video applications recognize it straight away and you know you can drop things into there. Just literally drag and drop, copy them in. The screenshots and videos that you save from your Oculus Go, recording via that, are saved in the Oculus folders. Under Oculus folder, you've got screenshots, which are screenshots, and video shots, which are not screenshots, but videos. So they don't have any audio, but they're the clips that you record with your headset. So they get stored in there. So you can just double click. I don't have any in the moment, but that's where you'd find them. And when you're finished, just disconnect your headset from the USB, it'll disconnect from your PC and you're sorted. So then you can just jump into your headset, choose a video player or anything like that. Let's choose Skybox. And from here, you can choose any video files that you've saved. Um, any music or anything, you know, anything you've saved on and put over on here. So any photos and that sort of thing. It's great for if you've got really high quality stuff that you want to view on your headset, because if you also stream it, it's not that great quality. Uh, so you can literally just click directory and here you can see the same directory that you see on your PC where everything is saved. So you could go to your movies, access your movies, your pictures, if you want to put, you know, these pictures, or put your podcast in there, anything else. Uh, and there you go play and off you go. Hopefully that video helped. Subscribe for more Oculus Go videos and other videos. Let me know in the comments down below if there's anything else you want to see. Give the video a thumbs up if you liked it and uh, it found it helpful. Uh, give it a thumbs down if you didn't, that's fine. But do let me know in the comments down below why give it a thumbs down just so I can improve my videos going forward. And I think that's pretty much me done. I'm out, take it easy.